Hulk was wandering around on planet Decopodia, eating some strange alien fruit, when he suddenly heard someone call his name. He turned around and saw Doctor Strange walking towards him. Doctor. Banner? Strange called softly. Please listen to me for a moment. Hulk gave him a hard look, but Strange kept going. Don't you recognize me? It's me, Stephen Strange. Just a bit behind them, Agent Becerra was watching closely, and something about the whole situation made her feel uneasy. That's odd, she whispered to herself. Dr. Strange continued speaking calmly. Bruce, you need to understand. You can't stay here. You need to go back to the crossroads. But Hulk didn't respond. He closed his eyes as if trying to remember something. Images of his past, both as Bruce Banner and as Hulk, flashed in his mind. Strange tried again. Bruce, he called softly. Hulk's eyes shot open, and without warning, he swung his massive fist at Strange. Please just listen, Strange shouted, but Hulk was too angry to listen. He began throwing things wildly around the cave. Agent Becerra, watch out! Strange yelled. Becerra jumped aside just in time to avoid a huge rock. As she got back up, she noticed something shining on the ground. Wait, what is that? She murmured, curious. Meanwhile, Strange tried once more to reach Hulk. Bruce, if there's any part of you left in there, he started to say, but Hulk cut him off with a deafening roar that echoed around the cave. Strange knew he had to stop Hulk before he destroyed everything, so he quickly tried casting a spell. Okay, this has to end, he said, his hands glowing with magic. But just as the spell started, it fizzled out and disappeared. What? It didn't work, he whispered, staring at his hands in shock. Hulk, seeing that Strange's magic had failed, roared even louder, getting even angrier. Agent Becerra ran up to Strange. What happened? She asked, worried. Strange looked confused and shook his head. I tried to send Hulk back to the crossroads, but something's blocking my magic. It's like a barrier keeping us trapped here, too. Who would do that? Becerra asked, looking around. Strange floated up a few feet, his cape swirling. I don't know, but Hulk could still leave whenever he wants. I put a special spell deep inside his mind, so no one can stop him from going back to the crossroads. Becerra frowned. You mean, he can still leave if he wants to? She asked. Yes, Strange answered. But he has to choose to leave. Becerra then remembered something. I saw something weird in that cave. Those shells looked very old, and I think Hulk was eating. But before she could finish, Strange pointed to something in the distance. Look! They quickly flew up to a higher point to get a better view. When they looked down, they saw the city below, but it looked very strange. The city, it looks different, Strange said, sounding confused. Like it's more advanced. Becerra looked down, her eyes wide. What, how, she asked. Strange kept staring. New buildings, advanced technology, but that shouldn't be possible here. They flew closer to one of the tallest buildings landing on its rooftop. Could it be magic? Becerra asked. Strange shook his head. No, I would have sensed it. 